What is up everybody, Garden State Aviation here, back with another video. This is NG Models May 2022 releases. Without further ado, let's take a look at them. So starting off here, this is what I've been waiting for NG to release for quite a while. I didn't think any model company would be able to pull this off, but this is a United 737-800 in their Star Wars livery. This is... This is definitely on a list, on my list of models that I want. This is definitely at the top, because look at it. Like, NG said that they weren't able to pull this off, and now they actually did. I'm definitely going to get this. But uh, the registration on it is uh, November 36272, and it's 4899 But this is definitely a model that I do want to get, because look at it. Anyway, continuing on down the line, we have a Shenzhen Airlines 77900 with that winglets. Registration is Bravo 5102, and the price on this is 4699. Moving on down the line, we have a TWA 747SP, registration number 57203. Looks pretty nice, uh, and the price on it is 5799. And here, we have a lot of 747SPs in this video, so we have four of them. Uh, one of them is a Transworld that I just talked about. Uh, and then uh, other three are Pan Am 747SP. So this Pan Am one, uh, it has like Clipper America on it, or like Flight 5. It has like this little uh, sticker on it. The registration is from November 515 Papa Alpha. Uh, it's $57.99. Uh, and the other one, actually all of them have the registration number 533 Papa Alpha. So the second one just has like the Clipper thing on it, the Clipper sticker. Uh, and the last one just has the Clipper New Horizons and then the uh, Flight 50 logo. So this is all the same registration aircraft number 533 Papa Alpha. And all of these models are $57.99. Moving on down the line, we have a Qatar Airlines uh, 777-300. This is a very interesting livery. Uh, I've never actually seen this myself. I don't know why NG didn't just release this yeah, just in their normal black uh, colors. Just like uh, in their gray, black, you know, the normal Qatar Airlines every. But um, I still do think this model is going to sell really well. Registration is Alpha 7 Bravo Oscar Alpha A7 BOA. It's $59.99. Continuing on, we have the Qatar One World White Livery 777-300. Registration is Alpha 7 Bravo Alpha Foxtrot. Uh, this one's also $57.99, or $59.99. Both of these are $59.99. And the really exciting thing about this release is there's a lot of models uh, that I want from this release. Uh, and continuing on the line, we have a British Airways 777-200ER. Now, this I definitely do want to get, because British just started up their service back to Newark, I believe, last November or December, so this is a model that I really want to get because British Airways fly their triple twos uh, into Newark. But um, yeah, registration is Golf India, Golf Victor India India Yankee, and it's fifty nine ninety nine. And the other British Airways triple seven two hundred dr has the England Rose Tail. Now for some reason they couldn't produce the clip art of this aircraft, but still, this is I believe back from back in the time when British Airways did the entire thing with the different. Uh, tails are presenting different parts of the world, but um, <laughs> there's a plane in the background. Uh, anyway, uh, registration is Golf Vind uh, Victor India ADC here, GVIIS, and it's $59.99. And we have yet another Japan Airlines being released. Uh, we have two of them. Uh, this one is a One World 77 9 registration Juliet Alpha 861 Juliet, and the other one is, I believe, a normal livery, except with just like this. Uh, JA Sky Suite 787 little sticker, but the registration on this one is also Juliet Alpha 861 Juliet. Now, I don't know if this is the case in real life that they have uh, that maybe this is just different iterations of delivery uh, throughout time, but uh, I do think that this either this could be a mistake or it's the exact same delivery. Anywho, moving on down the line, we have an Air China AT3200 uh, with what is this called? This is called the Jin Lee CS sticker. Uh, registration is Bravo 6071. Uh, it's 1 to 400, and the price is $55.99. Okay, so here we have the French BA 5900. Now, many of you might be thinking, why would they release another version of it? Well, because the one that was released I had two or three months ago, uh, that one actually 
with the misprinted on the bottom and I believe either left or right side of the fuselage, they misprint the title. So this is a re-release. Uh, so essentially people like me who got the incorrect titles, uh, we're going to get this model for free. Uh, and then this is also just for uh, people who want the French B850-900 who didn't have the chance to get it in the last release But this one actually does have a different registration. It's Foxtrot Hotel Romeo Echo Yankee F-H-R-E-Y and it's $57.99 Here we have a Fiji Airways AT-15-900 in their normal livery Registration is Delta Quebec Foxtrot Alpha India and the price is $57.99 and here we have the first ever NG Models Tupolev TU-154 release. Uh, NG Models has been hyping this up for quite a while now. They've, I believe they hinted to this mold, I believe, two or three weeks ago. And so this is definitely uh, a model that is on my bucket list to get because it's a TU-154. Why not? But um, registration is CCP, so CCCP. Uh, 85662 uh, and it's 4699 this I believe I believe the 2 plus T154 mold is actually not the cheapest you can get from NG models but um yeah continue on the line we have a Chinese Air Force Jean Y20 this is like the third or fourth release of it already they released a bunch of them last year so uh, I guess it's because of popular demand uh, but I do know that there's some model stores that are still selling it. Uh, but the registration on this is uh, 22046 and it's $55.99. Now, all the models I just talked about were 1 to 400, and now let's continue on to the 1 to 200 models. Here I have a uh, Mexicana Link CRJ 200ER. Registration is X ray Alpha India Mike India. Uh, it's scale 1 to 200, and the price is $68. Moving on down the line, we have the final models of this release. We have an Air China ARJ21700. The registration is Bravo 605 Uniform, and the price on this one is $72. But uh, if you look at the clip art, it's a bit strange that there's no engines uh, on the back of the fuselage. So that's a bit strange. Like lately, NG Models clip art has been kind of whack, but uh, as long as actual models are good, I have no complaints. But uh, yeah, um, what I definitely do want to get from this release is United Star Wars because I mean, no other model company has released this, and I mean, look at it. it th th this is gonna look so cool on a model. But um, this is the United Star Wars is definitely one that I want to get, uh, along with the British Airways Triple Seven Two Hundred ER because they fly to Newark. Uh, but then other than that, there really isn't anything else that I need from this release. Uh, but if I had uh, money left over, I'd probably go for the Airflow TU-154, which is really cool. Anywho, that being said, that does conclude this video. If you guys like the video, please like, subscribe, and turn the notification bell so you my videos, and comment down below what you're getting from this release. Once again, thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in the next video. As always, goodbye.